Hey guys, what's up? In this video, I'm going to be teaching you how to enable multitasking as well as wallpapers for the iPhone 3G and iPod Touch 2G. Before we begin, three important notes to look at, be on the lookout for. First off, this is for Mac only. So if you are on Windows, please subscribe as the Windows version will be released soon and I will have a video when it comes out. So subscribe so you don't miss that. But again, this is Mac only. Second off, if you are on an unlocked iPhone 3G or you rely on any type of unlock for your iPhone 3G, do not do this guide. It will mess up your iPhone permanently and you will not be able to use it. So again, if you are on an unlocked 3G, do not do this. And thirdly, um, this does require jailbreaking your phone or iPod Touch 2G. So again, if you do not want your phone or iPod jailbroken, do not do this as we must jailbreak it for this to be possible. So to begin, for those who don't know, not Apple Insider, for those who don't know, I'm going to go to apple.com and show you what the iOS 4 update is. Now, most of you probably already know what it is if you're watching this video, but for those who don't know, essentially it is Apple's latest update for their iPhone and iPod Touch in which you can have multitasking to run more than one app at the same time and quickly switch between them as well as a wallpaper behind your icons as you can see in this screenshot rather than just having a black blank screen as it was in the past so these were the two most anticipated features of iOS 4 multitasking and wallpaper however Apple left them out of the iPhone 3G and iPod Touch 2G for some unknown reason probably because it would slow down the devices but in this guide I'm going to be teaching you how to enable those features on the iPhone 3G and iPod Touch if you so wish so first off the first thing you're going to want to do is download a program it's called Red Snow as you can see in this screenshot and the link to the download will be in the description as well as the link to this original article will be in the description just in case you want a written guide as well. So once you have downloaded the program, you're going to want to open it up and plug up your device. If iTunes comes up, exit it, and it's going to say, it's going to give you these options to jailbreak your phone. It's going to say install Cydia, custom boot logo, custom recovery logo, and enable multitasking and wallpaper you're going to want to select install Cydia and enable multitasking and wallpaper and click next and once you click next as you can see in the guide right here it says the rest of the jailbreaking steps should be pretty straightforward so it's going to ask you to plug in your device and just let it go and if you need the posted guide the article is going to be in the description again for the text and once your device is jailbroken and then reboots you will have wallpapers and multitasking on your iPhone 3G or iPod Touch 2G as well as you will be jailbroken two in one so it's twice the fun for one simple step if this helped you out in any way guys please subscribe I greatly appreciate it also please rate this video thumbs up as that is my favorite thing that you guys do and I really enjoy it when you do that as weird as that sentence may have sounded and stay tuned for the next video follow me on Twitter and visit my blog which are all in the description and I will be catching you in the next video guys see you later